If we compare this to the United States, <clears throat> where we, um, although we had policies to support, we had the US Department of Agriculture to support uh, the innovation of new technologies on land, and we had uh, policies that some would see as very um, uh, hostile towards small farm ownership and more favorable towards large uh, capital intensive farming. Uh, during the 1930s, a lot of farmers lost their land. Both of my grandfathers lost their land, um, and both of them, one became a used car salesman and the other became a factory farmer. Um, but this was the process of capitalist um, transformation of agriculture. Uh, and as farmers fled their land, sold their farms to larger agricultural businesses, and um, rural agricultural work became proletarianized, you saw the consolidation of farm sizes uh, in the United States and an increase in agricultural production as they adopted more modern technologies. In fact, my maternal grandfather, the reason that he lost his farm was that as a small farmer, he tried to buy all the latest equipment and he couldn't afford it because his farm wasn't big enough and that's why he went bankrupt. Thank you.